Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. It is Tasty Lacey. So today I decided to try the can Cantina Crispy Melt Taco from Taco Bell. And I also, I got the box and it comes with the Beef Crunchy Taco and the uh, Beef Chalupa Supreme. Of course you, I didn't even know it came with the box. I just wanted to order the, I should have said that, but anyway, I got the box. Uh, and a plus a Mountain Dew. I asked for three hot sauces. I didn't get it. As you can tell, it's empty. All I got is tacos. And I have my Mountain Dew. So, what I do is I keep all my sauces. Either whatever I eat, go out to eat. I got my ketchup and everything. Who does that? And put a little Ziploc bag. I've been doing this for, for a while now. So, let me get my sauces out since I didn't get them at Taco Bell. I should have checked my box, but I didn't like a dummy. But anyway, let's get to eating. Let me say my grace. Amen. So how was y'all's day today? Happy uh, Wednesday. It's hump day, y'all. Oh my God, this week is flying by. Okay, let's try. I think this is the cantina if I'm not mistaken what is this let me know if, I guess this, have y'all tried this all right y'all it's got tomatoes on here and I'm gonna try it with tomatoes and I don't like tomatoes but we're gonna give it a try let me take this out of the bag I mean the paper let me show y'all what it looks like I had a warm Warm it back up in the microwave. Of course, it's got the tomatoes. Look at that steam, y'all. Tomatoes, the cheese, of course, the beef. Does it have onions in it? No, it's just the lettuce. Sorry, y'all. Looks like it's just a plain old, just a plain old taco. It's just crispy. And with the cheese. Let's give us a bite. Thumbnail. Mm. Mm. I'm shocked I'm trying this with tomatoes. Y'all didn't tell me to put the sauce on here. I forgot all about it. And it's got, oh yeah, sour cream. You might as well say this is almost like cooked tomatoes. Now, I'll eat cooked tomatoes. I love stewed tomatoes. It's just the raw tomatoes I don't care for. And I'm going to try to do that bold BLT by Get Lit. What is it? Get Lit with Mo. Let me know if I say, say the name right. Everybody's doing that challenge. Big bold BLT. That's the challenge. Mm. Mm -hmm. That's messy, y'all. Oh, that's messy. But it's good. is messy. I'm just going to scoop it up with my fingers. It's going to be a messy video. I'm getting every bite. I didn't pay $5.30 for this. Okay, this is a keeper. Now, this is just for um, is this limited time or what? 
because I'll go back to this. This is banging. It's banging, banging. Okay. Mm. I'm hungry too. Oh yeah, I like it with that nacho cheese. Oh, that's banging. Yeah. If they keep us on the menu, I'm going back for another one. I'll keep going back. All right, let's get this regular taco out of the way. Of course, y'all know what a regular taco looks like. I got the fire sauce and the hot. Oh, shout out to one of my subscribers. I think his birthday already passed. He's a Scorpio. Leonard McNeil, happy birthday. Happy belated birthday. He, he told me his birthday was coming up. I think it's already passed. I think it was last month. So, shout out to all the Scorpios out there. Let me know if y'all Scorpio. Put it in the comments. Me personally, I'm an, I prefer Aquarius because <laughs> I'm an Aquarius. I have nothing wrong with um, nothing wrong with all the zodiac signs, but Aquarius we lit. We popping. My favorite one, I like them. The crispy taco, the new one, Cantina. Cantina? Sorry, y'all. And I love my chalupas. Oh, that's the wrong way, y'all. This one's the beef chalupa. And this is the supreme. I always like the um, chicken. Chicken chalupas. Or it was a beef, yeah, chicken chalupas. They used to have steak chalupas. I don't know if they got that anymore. Let me get some more sauce, y'all. Okay, um, uh, let's see. Nancy McKeon, she uh, told me about another movie. It's called A Cry for Help. It's a 1989 movie. Girl, I've seen that before, yes. And that was really good. Her husband was abusive, and um, he did stab her uh, several times. I think she made it. She made it through, but she ended up, you know, she had to go to the hospital and recover. She did recover, but this was a good movie. I'm gonna have to look it up and watch it again. I might watch it again. Uh, I might watch it tomorrow or or today. But yeah, it's called A Cry for Help, and uh, she said it's Nancy McKeon, member from The Facts of Life. Well, she's in it. I forgot the husband's name, but he was... Ugh, I just... Ugh. That one. Now, the movie I might watch tonight is Flowers in the Attic. Now, that one's a classic. Remember that scene at the end where... Uh, let's see. They were, the mother was getting married. I'm going to try to reenact this, but no. <laughs> Remember what she said? The daughter came out of the attic and stuff. They were walking down the aisle. 
and she's trying to force the cookie. It's the cookie mother! <laughs> that was a good one. So if y'all haven't watched Flowers in the Attic, it's another classic. Of course, it's based on a book, but the movie's good. I'm gonna take some of these tomatoes off. I love that scene. Eat the cookie, mother! And then she fought, and the mother falls off the because she was forced and she was falling and she fell off the balcony. Y'all had to watch it. It's an old classic. Another old classic. Boy, like they don't make old they don't make movies like anymore. Back in the day. And then, of course, I can go on and on about uh, older movies. Mommy Dearest. Mommy Dearest. Faye Dunaway in it. She played Joan Crawford. Baby, I love that movie. I've watched that movie over and over. My mom got me to watching that one back in the day. Baby, that's a good one. I have that movie. Mmm. Yeah, if y'all haven't seen those, baby, watch it. Oh, these are messy today. I'll put in the title, Messy Eating. Because I know some of y'all don't like messy eating. Look at that. Mm. Joan Crawford was wrong for that. At the end, not giving her kids um, any money when she passed on. Didn't give her, didn't give them nothing, and they went through through so much abuse, especially Christina. The little boy didn't get touched, but he was always strapped in the freaking bed. What kills me, what gets me is the bathroom scene. You know, when she goes through, first she goes in the kid's uh, closet. She found that one wire hanger. She goes off. No wire hangers ever. And, it, and it's on. <laughs> She's like, Christina, get out of that bed. See, I know the wire. <laughs> I know the lines. But let me get off here before I start re uh, reciting them. But anyway, I just want to come on here. <laughs> yeah, you know. Uh, that, yeah, that's my favorite movie, too. Mommy Dearest. Y'all need to go watch it. Out. Based on Joan Crawford, the movie actress. She was just mean. But anyway, y'all, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys next time with another video. Bye.